Okay, so I I noticed that they've been piling some loose debris right over the water tower. And then I was looking at it and noticed that it was moving, which I thought was interesting and worthy of recording. So I, I've been trying to, I was trying to record this with the red uh, film over so not to disturb them. Uh, I just couldn't get to focus. But so the, they've, you know, so I pulled the, the red lid off. So they're exposed to light. They're all irritated right now. Um, and they're moving stuff around. They've been kind of clearing out the debris, but yeah, it was a pile of sand right there. You could see right in the middle. And I just noticed it was moving and I was able, I was able to see it through the red. The camera just isn't able to pick it up. And it appears that they buried their larvae in there. Now, again, I'm new to ant keeping, so I'm not quite certain why they would do this. But yeah, they gathered some loose debris and then, and it looks to me like it's larvae in there. Let me see if I can zoom in a little bit. I kind of I missed that. They're they're also hiding under this central. Yeah, you could see they snuck a larvae in right there. It looked like a pupate. But yeah, I'm kind of curious what they're doing right there. Oh come on, camera! What is in there? Focus. Okay. So this is this is fascinating. And this is not sped up. These these guys move. It's funny when they're undisturbed. They're very close, very slow, methodical in their movements. Um. But when you disturb them, these these guys move, and they're. I'm zoomed in, but looking looking around the nest, they are just all over the place. They are not happy campers. But I am very fascinated as to what this is under here. Because <laughs> I'm not sure if it's a larva. It's moving a lot. It looks big. I don't really want to mess with it, but it's moving an awful lot. I'm assuming it's a larvae. And for those of you that are bored enough to watch this, um, yeah, not much is happening. I'm just, this is fascinating to me, so I'm kind of curious to see what it is. I'm assuming it's a larvae. And earlier in the video, I don't know if you captured it, I was messing around with the zoom, but it looked like they hit a couple, uh, looked like pupates. So they, they're running around this, but they don't seem all that interested. I don't know what. I'm hoping they'll move it out of here, because I'm, I'm very anxious to know what it is. It's moving a lot. I'm going to try this without the flash. I'll probably end up losing this video, but... Pan around here, see what's going on. There's our queen. This is what I'm really interested in. Focus. Thank you.
Well, you know, I think that probably just says a larvae under there because the larvae are, are getting... They're definitely bigger. I mean, look at that thing compared to the actual uh, worker right there, the nanotech. Um, you know, so I, I think this next next batch of ants are going to certainly be a lot larger. So, yeah, it's... Yeah, I don't understand why they're burying that one in sand while this, you know, this one and many others are still in this um, root or not. I, I, it's very strange, but again, I'm so new to it, I don't know what is common and what's not. I think I've harassed these guys enough. Call of the night. <laughs>